Hey guys, it's Renee. So for this DIY, I wanted to make this Vaseline chapstick prettier because I actually really like this chapstick. I think it's one of the best ones out there. It goes on really smooth on your lips, feels like nothing, like you're wearing nothing but hydrated. And my favorite part is like it's shiny. Looks like you're wearing lip gloss as opposed to a chapstick, but it's not sticky at all. It doesn't have any smell or anything. It's actually perfect, this one, and it's really affordable. <laughs> I'm kind of like giving you a mini review of this, but I really like it. And you can actually refill it. Like for instance, I'm almost done with this one, but I have a new one and I'm gonna refill this. Just place the new one and that's it. And so because I can do that, I'm gonna be decorating one. I'm gonna open it and I don't want it to dry. Just grab a napkin, make a small square and then just tape it in. And since this is plastic, to paint this, I'm going to be using some nail polish. I'm using this white nail polish and this black nail polish as well. The bottom part is going to be just black deep in this two coats. And this is pretty uh, opaque and just letting it dry in between coats. For my top part though, I'm going to be covering this in white. Feel free to use white spray paint. I just use this white nail polish because that's the only thing I got. And to make this easier for me to paint, I'm going to be using this highlighter, placing the cap in there and then just paint it, letting it dry in between coats. And I added three coats of this one, letting it dry in this pen and pencil holder. And this is where the fun begins. I'm going to be painting some roses. For that, I'm going to be using my dotting tool. I do have the DIY for this one, my palette thing and my black acrylic paint. And I'm just going to be dragging in a zigzag motion to paint. I I just did a really similar uh, design on my phone case where I explain a little more on what I do. If you saw this, hopefully this doesn't seem too repetitive, but I really like the pattern. I also have another DIY where I show you other designs for other chopsticks. Those are from like other brands. Feel free to check those out. But for this one, I'm going to be um, covering this in roses all over. And then I'm going to be using some gold paint and this other dotting tool that is actually a toothpick. But this toothpick is like cut it, so it's like thicker and this is a toothpick holder but I'm going to be placing uh, dots all over the place. I'm going to be adding some like sparkle with this glitter. They're actually really cute. Grabbing one glitter by one with my dotting tool and just placing those glitters in like the empty like spaces or wherever I feel like I need you know some shine. I'm going to be adding some gloss. The one that I'm using is a nail polish gloss. I'm adding this to protect the design and to make this whole thing glossy and like smooth but yeah guys this is what this chapstick case we could say it looks like i actually love it i really like it i'm glad i went for it because i'm obsessed with how it looks i think it looks vintage classic again if you use on this chapstick like the bezeling one you can refill it it's actually really easy to paint hopefully you found this helpful and you liked it too if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more diys that i have on my channel i share a bunch of things here subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and Take your bias.